Hi, welcome to SBL Foods. I'm Mukta Nagraj. Today, I'm showing vegetable sagu, an authentic Karnataka cuisine. This can go well with chapatis, puris, rotis, and this has a wide range of varieties in Karnataka. Here is one which I'm showing you today. I'm using lot of vegetables to this recipe. Let's begin. In a cooker pan, I'm going to add in the chopped vegetables. I have cut the brinjal, potato, but I've put them into water. I'm putting all the chopped vegetables. Here, potato and brinjal, I've put it into the water. So, no discolorization happens. Peas, then cabbage, beans, finely cut carrots, and some chocho, and some tomatoes. In the end, the amaranthus leaves, finely chopped. Going to put in some water. going to add in half the quantity of the salt which I need. Close in the lid and pressure cook for one whistle. By the time the vegetables get cooked, I can make the masalas ready. In a small wok, I am going to put in the green chilies. with little bit of oil. Little bit of sauteing is enough. I can turn the flame off. Then into a mixie, I'm going to add in the fried bran, coconut, and the remaining salt which I need to put for the gravy. And the chili is roasted. Very little of water. And make this into a fine paste. Now the vegetables are cooked. If you feel the water is more, you can always take a bit out and then start making the curry. Here I feel should be fine enough. I'm going to add in the grinded masala to this. I'm going to add in the garam masala. Little bit of sugar. Squeeze in some lemon and allow this to boil. While this is boiling, I will do a seasoning for this. Some mustard seeds and few curry leaves. Mixed vegetable sagu is ready to eat with hot puri, chapati, roti and what not, even goes good with bread. For more recipes, like and subscribe SPL Foods.